Day eight of the African Games will see the start of track and field events take place at the Moulay Abdallah Stadium in Rabat. Track and field is one of the 26 disciplines at the Games with numerous events for African nations to continue hunting for medals. CG10's Mohamed Abubakar has more from Rabat. With majority of the disciplines done and dusted, attention at the 2019 African Games will turn to the Moulay Abdallah Stadium in Rabat. The venue will host the track and field events for the next five days. I'm really excited because that is what we are here for. That's what we've been training all year round. And it's really great to be here for a couple of days and finally get to start something that, yeah, belongs to us. It's our event. That's something we enjoy doing. With the Games having been given a wide berth by many high-profile athletes on the continent, there are still names to look forward to over the course of the week. I have the Olympic champion here. I have the Olympic silver medalist here. So when you say that seasoned athletes have stayed out, I beg to differ. I mean, the youngsters are coming up. The old guards are coming up. The old guards have to hand, to hand over the baton to the youngsters. There's nothing, much, there's nothing better than the Olympic champions coming here to show the youngsters the way. Other nations will also be looking to use the competition here to develop their young and upcoming athletes. For these games, we've come with mostly our young talent. We see these as a platform for the young athletes, but we're also here to win medals. So I'm very confident that at the end of the event, we'll have done very well. All five days of athletics will have finals and medals awarded across the different events. With a little over a week into the Games already, the North African nations and South Africa are well on the top of the medal standings. But the beginning of the track and field events that will carry on to the end of this week will give other countries a chance to catch up with the leading nations on the log. Mohamed Abubakar for CGTN at the Moulay Abdullah Stadium in Rabat, Morocco.